The goal of this performance analysis was to monitor flame spread, smoke development, strength, and other safety factors in a controlled situation. Two identical block foundations were constructed, each 20 by 30 feet, consisting of a staircase with a flooring system above. In one structure, ordinary untreated lumber was used. The other structure was constructed with Drycon fire retardant treated lumber. Thermocouples were installed to measure temperatures at key locations that were recorded on graphs located in a control building adjacent to the foundation structures. Cotton balls were placed at prescribed heights to check for flashover, the sudden ignition of combustible gases. The easily ignited cotton balls also serve to simulate clothing, hair, or other highly combustible materials. The only source of fuel for each staircase fire was a crib of spruce lumber fueled by methyl alcohol that was poured into pans. The cribs were electronically ignited from the adjacent control building. The stairway on the left side of your screen is the dry con structure. The one on the right is the untreated wood. Upon ignition, fires spread quickly through both cribs and within seconds began touching the stairways. After one minute, the cribs continued to burn. The temperature above each crib measured 1550 degrees Fahrenheit. The stairs, constructed of untreated wood, had caught fire, while the stairs constructed of dry con fire retardant treated wood had not begun to burn. The structure on the left is dry con fire retardant treated wood. As the crib beneath the dry con continues to burn, the chemical treatment produces a char on the surface that creates an insulating shield, preventing the spread of fire. Combustible gases are converted to water and carbon dioxide, minimizing the potential for flame spread. After two and a half minutes, the temperature at the floor above the untreated structure had exceeded 1550 degrees. The corresponding temperature on the treated side never exceeded 650 degrees during the entire demonstration. Now the untreated stairway is on fire, and flames have moved several feet beyond the stairs. Fireballs of burning gases are moving across the floor framing. After eight minutes, the untreated structure continued to burn and showed increasing smoke density. The dry con stairway never caught fire during the performance analysis. At 12 and a half minutes, the fuel source had exhausted itself and fell apart. The staircase had not become a fuel source, and the fire could no longer burn. The untreated structure continued to burn. The fire consumed the wood staircase and burned through the door at the top of the stairs. The stairs collapsed, and the wood shroud above the stairs continued to burn. The entire floor system would have been consumed had the fire not been extinguished. The cotton balls, representing combustible materials in the untreated structure, all showed signs of flashover. Those closest to the ceiling had been totally consumed. After this demonstration, the dry con steps remained strong enough for people to walk on them.